Hey, how's it going? Recently, I've had an issue with the nested list view in Flutter, and I want to share this solution with you. So there are two possible use cases that I can think of. The first example is when you have a list with an undetermined number of children, where each child has an undetermined number of children as well. And second example is gonna be a collapsible app bar with a sliver list, which has a determined number of children, but some of its children has an undetermined number of children in a list view. So let's get to the first one. I've got an empty project and let's build a first example. I'm gonna hard code this value, but in your project you would use a value fetched from your server, so you don't know this value, that's why it's a list view, not a column. Alright, let's try it. And nothing is displayed, right? So there is no red screen on your emulator, but if you go to Run tab, you're gonna see a pretty long log here. But on top of it, there is a stuff that helps to fix the problem. So we need to add a shrink wrap attribute for a nested list view, which can solve it. Set it to true, default is false. Let's make it more readable so that you can see which ones are nested and which one is a header list. Alright, so now it's more readable, you can see which one is a first level list and which are nested ones. We can also add some padding here. And the second issue here is that you can see our scroll effect on nested list views, which you don't want probably. And uh, it also can interfere with your touch events. This you can solve by setting a physics to this object. Let's try now. Right now it's disabled. And now let's go to the second example with a collapsible app bar. I'm gonna remove uh, this stuff from here. and it's gonna be a custom scroll view first child is gonna be a sliver up bar And now we're gonna put our sliver list in here. Uh, 
and uh, this is going to be a nested list view. Hard coded value as well. Let's try it. And it doesn't work again. So, again, just put a shrink wrap through, and it works. Let's add a header. Right, and I'm gonna extract it as a method so that I can put multiple copies of this Let's copy it out. Right, and now the or scroll effect interferes with the touch events. So what you need here is again the physics attribute like that, and now it works fine. Also, make a net bar to pin. Here is my collapsible app bar. So it wraps it for a nested list view in Flutter. You can find the source code with two examples in the description and click like if you liked it, subscribe, I'll talk to you later.